Hello all, Matthew Bodie here with yet another South African genealogy tutorial. Um, today I'll be focusing on utilizing the Transvaal marriage indexes and using those indexes to find the actual record on the website Family Search. So let's get straight into it. So straight up we'll look for the marriage of my second great, sorry, my third great uncle, Arthur George Coots who was married in Benoni in 1926. Of course, to use, if you want to use these indexes, you're probably, if you have to use these indexes, you probably have to search for the date first. So let me show you how you can do that. First, go to familysearch.org. And then under search, go to catalog. And then titles and type in Transvaal marriage index and search and you'll see the link to the catalog here and then once you have the catalog up scroll down to the years relevant to the person you're searching for so for instance his eldest child is born in 1927 so you can just assume they were married the year or two before or sometimes the same year and then browse the indexes. So we know he was married in 1926 and we know the date but just to be certain let's go and um, find the date in these indexes here. So Coots alphabetically starts with the letter C so the appropriate film for the year 1926 is this one here as you can tell by the title. These records are organized um, by town first and then alphabetically second, so you'll see what I mean. Alright, so the first image takes us to the letter A for the year 1927. That's not what we want, we want 1926. So let's go to the end of the film, which as you can see here, it's the second item in the description. So all right, so that takes us to the letter W. We need to go a bit further. Okay, we're in the letter B, further some more. Alright, so we're in the letter C now, and we're looking for the surname Coots. But as I said, he was married in Benoni, so at the moment we're in the registration district of Germiston. So let's go a few images earlier and see what that takes us to registration district wise. Right at the end of B there, so go about five images in. Alright, Benoni, here we go. Okay, so Benoni, here we have the registration district, and here we have Coots AG, which stands for Arthur George. For some reason, men are given initials in these indexes, and then women are given their, their full first name, and then their middle initial is written out. I don't know why, just that's the way it's organized. So anyway, now we have Benoni, we have the year 1926, and the reference number. So let's use this information to go and find the actual record. So to do that, you're going to want to go to Catalog here, and go to title, transfer, marriage, death. And the correct catalog will come up. The first three quarters of this catalog is civil deaths for the transfer. So we want to go down to the marriages, which are at the very bottom. And we're after the year 1926. So we need to go further down. Alright, here we go, 1926, and Benoni, 
alphabetically falls between Barberton and Heidelberg. So let's go into this film. And if we go to image about 500, let's see which town that takes us to. Just some forewarning, there are lots of duplicate images in these records. Alright, so we are in Benoni now, and the reference number for Benoni here is 118, and at the moment we're in 170. So if we go image 400, given the amount of duplicates in here, let's see where that takes us to. 141, so we need to go back quite a bit, there must be lots of duplicates. Alright, that's 108, so let's go a bit further, 116, a bit further, even more, 117, got about two more images in, again, alright, here we have it. The marriage record of my third great uncle, Arthur George Coots. Quite a nice record, it gives an exact date of birth as well. Alright, so that's one example. Now let's try and find the marriage of my second great aunt Anna Radomir to her first husband, Albert Fulyun. So let's same process, go to family search, catalog, and then search for the catalog, which is Transvaal Marriage Index. And um, her elder son was born in 1931, only a month after she married. Not that I knew that at the time, but he was born at the end of 1931. So logically, I calculated they were probably married at the very beginning of 1931. So we can go to marriage indexes, 1931, right here. Alphabetically, Rodemeyer falls between M and Z. So this is the film we want. Keep in mind, if you don't know the town where they were married, you're going to be doing a lot of scrolling. Right, so 1931, not the right town. Go about 300 images back. View back. Yeah, even further. Oops, I'm getting a bit confused here. We're looking for the letter R. Surname starting with the letter R. Right, so it should be after Q. Alright, fantastic. So, a few images back, because we want Brackpan. That was at Heidelberg, okay. Back some more, with Brits now. Okay, here we are, Bethel. So, let's go a bit further, and Brackpan should show up. No, right, Boxburg, Boxburg first. That's where Anna was born. Boxburg again. As I said, lots of duplicates in this collection, so just be mindful. Okay, Brackpan, 1931, and she was married at the end of the year. So there we have it, the 6th of October. So you'll notice some of these indexes will give you the date instead of a reference number. So for this, the purpose of this video, I chose um, both examples so you can see how to to find a marriage record using a reference number or a date. So now that we have the date of marriage, the 6th of October 1931, and a, a district, Brackpan, let's go and find the actual record. So Transvaal, marriage, death, 
and then let's click on that catalog and scroll down to the appropriate film. Whoops, okay, so this film, this catalog does not include 1931. So let's look up Transfile Marriage 1931 for the next catalog, and this is the one we're after. These, this is quite a nice catalog, it covers marriages all the way through to 1955. So here we have it. The appropriate film in this instance is 1931 Barberton through Johannesburg, because alphabetically that covers the registration district of Blackpen. Let's go about 500 images in and see what town that takes us to. Brackpan. So, if we go another 100 images in, are we still in Brackpan? Nope, we're in Brits. So, we'll go about 40 back. Okay, September, no, about 10 more in. We're looking for the, once again, the 6th of October. So now we're at the 12th. Let's go image 565. Nope, a bit further in. And here's the record we're after, Anna Radomir, marrying her first husband, Albert Fulian. I hope this um, video has been helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section of this video or send a private message to me and I'll be glad to help. I hope you have a great day and thank you for watching. Bye.